It's been so long since I've been here and filmed a video. Well, I have been filming. I just haven't been uploading because uh, it's it's been a while. I think it's been a month since I've uploaded and I don't even remember the settings for my camera. So if it doesn't get blurry or if it doesn't, if it's blurry, then I'm sorry. But so anyway, I just want to do like a quick like update video just so I can because I'm going to upload another video this week, but it's going to be of my Evie clips and um, I'm not going to, it's not going to be like an upload, upload style video. So I did want to have something in between since I've been gone for so long. So anyway, and I figured I would make <laughs> I have these little eyeballs. I could make these clips that I've been wanting to make um, Everly for a while now because I bought these so long ago and I'm like well I could just make these while I'm doing sharing my update so that is what today's video is if you want to see me make these clips that I'm gonna make then keep watching or if you want to hear an update then get ready because it's happening <laughs> so and my son's upstairs and I told him that we'd have quiet time but it's not going so well but anyway so I got these I want to tell you guys where I got these real quick. So I got these from when I, I used to sell felt hair clips. And I don't have, I mean, I've shared them in the past. And I have a tutorial on how I make them. And I will link it below. But I got this from, I think it's an Etsy shop called either the felt pod or the felted pod. Something like that. I will, um... I'll link them below though, but they have cute eyeball ones. I thought these would be cute for Halloween. And then I saw like these rainbow ones. I don't actually think I got these from that shop now that I'm looking at them. Um, I'll have to double check. But the that shop where I got these, that's where I would get, uh, I they had Easter egg, um, I keep saying um, Easter egg felt eggs that I would turn into clips and they have um, uh, like, strawberries and apples and all sorts of stuff it's so if you like making felt things i would definitely check them out and they have felt sheets and little felt balls and all that stuff but anyway <laughs> so okay uh so i have i don't know life has just been busy lately and i think i'm just gonna glue these just on top <laughs> look at that I was gonna glue it like this so then when I clip it to her just her head in front of like a bun you can see the eyeballs but if I do it like this she could wear it on the side of her head and I could also clip it into a bun like this so you still see it so I think that's what I'm gonna do so but it, and then these I usually I mean I'll link the tutorial below but I usually um line it with felt and put this on and then put like a felt thing, felt loop that this would go into. But honestly, I don't think I'm gonna <laughs> do that. So this really isn't that great of a tutorial at all. Just because it's for Everly and who, you know, she's not, by maybe I will. I don't know. I mean, that's so simple to just do it like that. We'll, we'll see, we'll do these first. But anyway, so I started a video of making this hair bow and I, I mean, I could honestly insert a clip right here. Okay, just kidding. <laughs> I forgot that I must have deleted the footage because it was not going well. Because I, so I was doing a surged bow that you just need a serger for and some fabric and not a sewing machine because I made one oh, that might have been two years ago and I was going to add it to my shop and this is a bit later that's why the sun is coming because I ran out of room on my memory card so I had to delete a bunch of stuff but anyway so I was working on that video and then wasted time with that because that didn't turn out and then I was working on a um, bag waist pants video which I think I still might do. I have some of it filmed and then I didn't finish it yet because my serger broke, but I can just make it without a serger. It's not a big deal. And uh, I have 
pretty much this Evie clip video has taken a long time to do. And it, my husband went back to work, so I didn't have... I used to be able to film a little bit each morning, but now that's completely gone. So it's just really hard to figure out all of this because I can't film normally during the day <laughs> unless we're having quiet time. And that usually isn't a thing. If you have kids, you know, it just doesn't work out. I wish I could make it so it looks like they're like cross-eyed. I think maybe, maybe if I do, kinda, right? I don't know. I think I want to do it like that. But anyway, so then that all is a thing. And then now it just sounds like I'm coming up with a bunch of excuses, but this is just a little update. I've decided that I'm not going to close my Me Made, even though I said a bajillion times that I was going to. I'm just going to glue this and pop it on. And like I said, I usually don't do it like this. Not that there's anything wrong with doing it like this. I don't think there is. I mean, we'll find out. I hope these little things stay on. Man, I might have to finish this video because I don't like it when it's super bright. But I can't put my body over there because I have to film it this way. Anyway, but I'm keeping my Mimi to open. And I decided I'm going to close LAZ Tuesday and just merge the two shops and do something like that which I didn't really want to do but it does make the most sense after thinking about it forever just to do it that way so that's what I'm gonna do even though I did just get my first a lazy Tuesday sale but I mean that's fine it is what it is so I'm gonna merge the two shops so I've been working on doing that and then I have a new YouTube banner which I didn't think would take so long to do but that took me if you've seen it, uh, like, gosh, over an hour, over two hours to get that. Gosh. And I'm just going to put a little bit of glue in between. So I need to think of a new YouTube name because I do, it's going to be mostly my shop stuff, but I do kind of want to make it kind of like an umbrella of everything just so it doesn't seem so random. Like if I want to do something that's not shop related. It doesn't seem so random because the shop name allows it, if that makes sense. How cute is that? And then it just, you can just like monsterize. So I want to get these done before Halloween. So I think I need a little bit more glue in between there. So if you have <laughs> any suggestions on YouTube names, let me know. I just can't think of anything, you know? I don't know. And I just did made the new profile picture for Lazy Tuesday on my YouTube because that's what I was going to do. So I just wasted time doing that and now I'm going to redo it, but that's fine. And so now, yeah, I've been working on that kind of stuff. And then I need to oh and then I updated my Amazon shop storefront thing because I didn't want it to have just shop stuff I wanted it to have um other things that I do that's like what I'm going with the whole umbrella thing like I don't want to become like a lifestyle channel or a vlog channel or anything like that but I did want I don't know to open up the umbrella a little bit more so and then I finally decided that I need to start doing reels on Instagram because I was so hesitant or resistant on doing it because I think Instagram should be about pictures because that's what it was but after losing <laughs> like 500 followers which is fine and not growing at all because I don't do reels. I'm like, oh, I guess I can start doing reels. So, yeah. So I'm trying to think of, I know I'm not gonna be like super creative when it comes to that, just because I can't, I don't know. Can't. It doesn't feel like, what 
else. Oh, I'm like, why have I not been uploading? That doesn't seem like a lot of things going on. <laughs> but also, oh, it's so dark now. I might have to finish this later. Quiet time only lasts so long. <sighs> I don't know what to do. I'll be back, I guess, but I made that. And I'll come back with my story, <laughs> I guess. Ta-ta for a second. Okay, so I kind of had to block the window a little bit, but that's okay. <laughs> Hopefully that thing doesn't fall. But anyway, so I don't remember what I was talking about, but um, what else? I do know that I'm posting this one hopefully tomorrow, which would be Tuesday. And then my other video making the Evy clips on Wednesday or Thursday because those draw launch. I'm going to add those to my shop on this Friday. So, so I didn't know if I was going to add a felt, but I decided I'm going to because I do want a piece of felt like this to go through like that because I just think it grips the hair better in my experience so and you don't see this part and if it was for a customer like if I was gonna sell it I would make it a little bit nicer looking but it's just for my child so I think it'll be fine well I know it'll be fine and Sorry, my cat is meowing at something. Anyway. But also, I did film, because I mentioned that I was going to have a second channel. I mean, now, saying it, it kind of seems silly, because I don't have a lot of time. <laughs> That's why I haven't been posting. But, I so I don't know what I'm going to do with that. Um, I still might make one, like, once things kind of cool down a little bit. Or I'll just be like one where I don't post like every week or like maybe a couple of times a month. So I did film like three videos for that. So that kind of took up a lot of time. But I still have to like make a channel aim and do all that stuff. So yeah, but that one's like a like a more like baking and cooking type of one since I went to culinary school I just think it would be fun to do a video on that now I gotta think of what side I want her to wear this on this would be on her right side I think I'm gonna do that you could just not glue it but I like to just so it doesn't slide out and it doesn't matter to me that the clip shows so if you didn't like that you could cover this with like a I don't know a darker color or something but anyway so I had that those videos going on and then I am also painting a mural in my son's room which has taken a long time I'll insert a picture here if I have one and I'm gonna talk like I did insert that photo even if I didn't <laughs> but all those little character things they take so long to paint because I have to wait for sometimes I have to wait for the first layer to dry and then obviously paint on top and then I don't know if I mentioned this I probably I feel like I might have but maybe I didn't we got fish and we've been I think ugh, I feel like I mentioned this but I'll mention it again we got fish fish um about a month ago so, so maybe I didn't mention it, but, and that's been like a whole thing. And I know that might sound silly, but one of the fish, well, it took a bit to make, have them live longer than a day, but well, just like one batch. But anyway, so that's been a thing and adding, whenever I add something new to my plate, it kind of like disrupts everything else that I have to get done. And I'm sure if you have kids, you can relate. Like, 
you kind of have a routine and then when something else pops up like everything gets pushed back a little bit so yeah but we bought a fish um this fish wasn't one of the like original fish it was like i don't remember what like we got this a few weeks or a couple weeks after we got the fish the first batch of fish those ones are st like still alive this is just we wanted more fish and we got a female fish and she was in a tank with other female fish but she had babies the next day so that was something that was kind of exciting but like my gosh so now we have to we still need to get another tank for them all but she had like 10 no like 12 ish babies but we had ghost shrimp in the tank too and the ghost fish ate some of the baby like ate a couple of the babies and that was so sad so i took the ghost the ghost shrimp out i think i'll do this on this side and i'll have this one on this side my gosh that was it was horrific should i have moved it down a little yeah it's fine so anyway that was something what else i'm feeling really motivated about this all my shop and stuff i was feeling a little discouraged just with like because i was going to close it down and then i'm like well then what am i going to do and all this stuff but now that i'm converting it over um i think it'll be fine like i'm gonna convert i so the next videos is gonna be well i have a few already filmed but i'm gonna have to move or convert some of the things to a lazy tuesday like i had those bookmarks oh god so like these bookmarks if you you might have seen them but they have a lazy tuesday on the bottom so i think i'm gonna just cut those and make them a little bit shorter and then around the edges and then put them in my mimi made shop because they're still really nice like i really like these and doing like a few things like that um so it can all just be in one shop the only thing that kind of sucks is that my scrunchies they have a lazy tuesday on them on the tag and i don't think i'm gonna get mimey made tags Ugh, i think i would just have them be bare scrunchies which kind of sucks but kind of doesn't i don't know i guess it could go either way it would be cool to have the tags but it's not something that i want to like put effort into doing right now so I don't know what to do with these tags. Like, I don't know. Like, I'm not going to cut them off or anything. But I could, maybe I'll do, give them as, like, gifts or a giveaway or something. I don't know. And then I'll have, like, the the charms that I never got around to putting into my shop. <laughs> but I will, I'm going to work on that. So I'll have earrings and stuff in the shop. So it's going to be like a whole new, not like a rebrand because I'm not going to mess with the logo or anything, but just, I don't know, it's going to be a new chapter of my me made. So yeah, but I didn't want to, yeah, I didn't want to change my channel name to my me made just in case. I just want to have, you know, like an umbrella and have a bunch of things underneath the umbrella. So I just need to figure out what the umbrella is going to be called. But anyway, so that's where I've been. And of course, like other things pop up and like life happens and that's what happens. So yeah, but I think I'm back. Like I have a good, I think I'm at a good starting point. I have videos ready to go. Well, they need to be edited, but I have them filmed and I have ideas. So I think I'm in a good spot. So yeah, but if, <laughs> I hope you liked this video. I know it was kind of, nothing ex too exciting um maybe just a quick diy if you have a kiddo and want to make easy clips i'll have the shop where i got both of these if it's not the same shop in the description box but really i just i guess i just glued them to clips and i have these linked to my 
Amazon storefront too. So yeah, so I think that's it. And my next video will be in a couple days. Like I said, I think it, I'm going to put it up on Wednesday or Thursday. So I will see you guys then. And thank you guys so much for watching. And if you're still here, even though I didn't upload for a month, thank you so much. And I'm going to get better and it's going to be great. And thanks again. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.